We are incredibly excited today to introduce our special guest. She has 45 European Championships under her belt, eight Olympic medals, including one gold at a fourth Winter Games in Pyeongchang. Let's give a big warm welcome to Italian national sports hero, Ariana Fontana. Buongiorno. <laughs> and Hi. ciao from Beijing. <laughs> Hi. I'm in Bormio training with the, with the rest of my teammates. We, you know, just few few days and then we're gonna be there in Beijing, so it's exciting. Yeah. Do you mind actually if we, well, cheekily ask you to give us a room tour? No problem. <laughs> Mille grazie. So I have my bikes, uh -huh. the one, the green one is the one I warm up and it comes with me most of the time at also competitions. For my blades, um, these are my skates. Those look dangerous. Very much um, so. Yeah, they're really, they actually really hard. I used, I used it one time to, for fun to cut, a, cut some meat and they work pretty well. Oh, okay. <laughs> so what's yeah. like the main difference, of probably like the blades, right, between um, like track and uh, uh, figure skating? Um, short track blades are longer and thinner. Mm -hmm. uh, figure skater blades are shorter and more thick and more round because then obviously they need to jump. For us, we need to glide more on the on the ice. I mean, what are your expectations for Beijing 2022 now that you're pretty much standing at the zenith? Well, um, you know, um, like you said, I'm, I'm tied at eight Olympic medals with two male athletes that retired. So it would be nice to beat them um, because <laughs> I, the, the two of them, Apollon and Victor Anna, are, I think are two legends of this sport. Mm -hmm. and already be tied with them it's for me it's an honor um but having you know just even just one more medal more than them you know it will be a huge thing for me personally um but um i think that you know i want to approach these olympic games like i did the last two i'm not thinking really about the the medal or the, the final result i need to be first I need to be first in the in the finals, and then when when I'm in the final, I'll obviously I will do everything I can to to be on that podium. After Sochi, uh, a lot of things changed for both you and uh, and the way you train, and also obviously your husband mm. as well, right? Yeah, he became my coach, and you know it's not something that we decided out of the blue. Obviously, at Sochi I didn't win that gold medal. I was going for Pyeongchang, and I wanted to make sure that I was gonna do everything I could to be there 100%. So I need, needed some extra help. I needed that I needed help and Anthony was there. I like the way he we, he worked with me, the way he thing. I think it worked out pretty well, you know, that I won that gold medal. I, he promised me also that I was gonna be competitive in the thousand meter, that it's the distance that I always suffer more and in Pyeongchang I also got a bronze medal in that distance so everything worked out pretty well and he showed me that you know there was another level in me as an athlete and that's why I wanted to keep skating and you know be ready for Beijing because I wanted to see I was curious to see what other level I could reach with his training with his help. And what's the plan then for you like after Beijing? What's 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 up next then? I have a lot of people that would like to see me keep skating uh, for you know the home Olympics in 2026. You know it will be the perfect way to end my career because I started skating. I mean my first Olympics was Torino 2006. So finish it in Italy will be the perfect way. Um, it's four years away, there are a lot of things that need to change, a lot of things happen. Maybe maybe it's time to change a few things uh, in this sport in a way so that we can make things better for the athletes. So we'll see what's going to happen. And we're yes. definitely <laughs> looking forward to meeting you here in Beijing then at the Olympics. So wishing you all thank the you. best for your training. And thank you so much for your time, thank you. Mariana. And thank, all thank the best you. of luck at the Olympics. Exactly. We'll see you soon. Go Rocket. Thanks. <laughs> see thank you. you. Ciao. <laughs>